How old are you? Wow. How old am I? I YouTube channel you know it's your girl Shereen aka Cher and in today's video I'll be doing a Q&A yes a Q&A so you guys can get to know me some more I got my questions from my IG and my Facebook pages and yeah let's jump right into the video what age did you discover your talent for here Okay, I discovered my talent for here like when I was a little girl, like about 13, 14 years. I used to run down to my neighbor's house and cream my friend here and Jerry Curls. You know them time they had them something there around the place and yeah. My always love cream here, so yeah. About 13 years old. What inspired you to do here? I think it's just a God-given talent. It's just a God-given talent. How many tattoos do you have? I have two tattoos. I have one here and I have one in my lower back. Where did you learn to do here? I learned to do here at Knox Community College um, in, in Cobbler, Manchester, Jamaica, through Hartshots NTA. What is your inspiration in life? My inspiration in life, my two beautiful daughters. Yeah, when I see those two girls, sometimes I feel like I want to throw in the towel, I feel like I want to give up. But when I look at them, think about their future, yeah, they're my inspiration. When you just started out as a hairdresser, did you feel discouraged? Sure. When I started out as a hairdresser, I was discouraged. I didn't have any money um, to really punch in my business and um, yeah, I was discouraged. But that didn't stop me from continuing. How is it growing up with the kids? Wow. Alright. How is it growing up with the kids? Um, good and bad. Mixed feelings. All right, with the kids, you know, you have happy times and you have sad times. You know, people stay. They're rude and they give trouble. And some of them don't want to hear. And then guess what? You see, when they start turning teenager, mm -hmm. so when our child gets to teenage years, it's a totally different child. And my daughter is at a teenage stage you now, and she a up already. But me and her, me and her. So yes, growing up with the kids, we have good times and we have bad times, but I would not see my life without them. I love them, love them, love them, love them. What are your strengths and weaknesses? Okay, my strengths and weaknesses. My strength would be my determination and my drive. I'm a driven person and I'm a go-getter. My weaknesses would be... <laughs> guess what, people? I'm miserable and moody. Miserable and moody bad. So I would say that's my weakness. Do you have any regrets in life? No regrets in life. No regrets in life. I would say each challenge that we go through in life or what we would call regrets, I would, I, I, I would say I use them as stepping stones for another level in my life. So I think everything happens in life for a reason. And then when those things happen, it builds you for another stage. So no regrets in life. Where do you see yourself in the next five years? In the next five years, I see myself as a homeowner. Yeah, more of my own house. I'm tired of appearing. Tired of appearing. I could, have, could I have enough money, you know? I never have to appear so much rent. So I see myself as a homeowner. And I see myself as a celebrity here. Style. Yeah. How old are you? How old am I? <clears throat> wow. I am. I am 
over 30. That's all you guys gonna know. I'm over 30. I'm not too fast. How many kids do you have? I have two beautiful daughters. Two beautiful daughters. What was once fun to you but not anymore? All right, what was once fun to me but not anymore? That would be like um, nightlife, certain type of nightlife. You know, like when we used to go to parties and we had to leave, like we had to get ready like one o'clock in the night and go to parties or two of them time there. Yeah, them something there used to be fun to me, but no more, not, not fun to me anymore. And, and, and get what, guess, 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 guess what? Tongue twister, guess what, guys? Smoking. Smoking. <laughs> yes, smoking. We used to smoke every now and then. And I used to love that, but that's not fun to me anymore. If you were a man for a day, what would you do first? Rose and skirt, you know. Woya, woya, woya. All right, if I was a man for a day, what I would do first? I would throw a party to celebrate the fact that I don't have to wear no brassiere, I don't have to do no makeup, I don't have to have no period, and I don't have to go through no pregnancy. I don't have to have no child, I don't have to go through no stage of no pregnancy. Yeah, I don't do that. I would do that if I was a man for a day. Celebrate those things. So guys, yes, that's the end of my video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. And please remember to subscribe, like, comment, and share. And click the notification bell so you won't miss when I upload another video. Alright guys, so I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. My don't talk, my don't talk. See you guys in my next video.